Hey guys, and welcome to my channel. Um, I'm going to go ahead and apologize from the beginning. I don't know what is going on with my voice. I It's super scratchy. I don't know if I'm getting sick or just allergies or what is going on, but it's um, struggling. And I also had a really early morning this morning because I always do this to myself. I, when it comes to scheduling appointments, I always schedule the earliest appointment because I think that, you know, it's going to be better, you can get it out of the way, and all those things. And then I wake up that morning and I'm like, why? Why? So I had my oil changed this morning and honestly, I, it was the first time I got my oil changed in my new car and honestly, it was probably like the best experience that I've ever had. Like I was in and out in like a little over 30 minutes which is crazy because at the old dealership that I used to go for my old car, I, I was there probably a minimum of an hour and a half, and it usually went over that, which is insane. They were horrible about getting you in, even if you had an appointment. Like, they, would, they wouldn't actually get your car back, like, until, like, 45 minutes after you, like, originally got there. It was just, it was crazy, but... Anyways, enough of that. So <laughs> let's get to what I'm actually coming on here to talk about. Um, I'm planning on starting a new segment of videos. Um, I'm going to be doing a video like this probably once a month. It just kind of depends on how much content I have to talk about. Um, I was thinking about doing this weekly, but I don't think I'm going to have enough to talk about. So. That's why I'm kind of going to do it like once a month, but we'll just kind of play it by ear. But pretty much what I'm going to be talking about is two different topics. So the first topic, and well, actually, let's rewind a little bit. So um, for those of you who do not know me, when it comes to skincare, makeup, and pretty much like any other kind of beauty product, I am the type of person who likes to use one product at a time and use that product up until the end and then I move on to a new product. Um, there are a couple reasons why I do this. One of the reasons is um, when it comes to incorporating new products into my routine, I like to incorporate only like one at a time and the reason I like to do that is because if for some reason my skin has a reaction or breaks out or you know gets a rash or something like I know that that's the only new product that I have like tried so I know that that is the product that you know caused that um, when you are trying out like many different products like each day you kind of don't know what product is causing you to break out and so you have to kind of play a guessing game and trial and error and that whole thing which is just annoying. Um, another thing is, and this is specifically more important for skincare, but um, in order to see the effects of a skincare product you have to use it over time. Um, and so you know, it's really important to me, like, I want to see the total effects that the skincare has on my skin, and so for me, using up the product until it is complete, that kind of gives me a sense of, you know, what, what the skincare really does for me, because if you're switching it every single day, you're not really going to see the effects of that one specific product. So that's pretty much why I do it the way that I do, and it's just easier for me. So what this video is going to be, as I said, it's going to be kind of two topics. Um, the first topic is going to be going over products that I just recently incorporated into my routines and kind of my first impression of the product. Um, and then the second topic is going to be me talking about products that I recently completed, um, products that I recently finished, and kind of my overall review. Um, and it's going to be interesting because you know, sometimes in the future, sometimes first impressions are different from, like, final reviews. Um, there have been times when I, like, when I first start using a product, I'm like, oh, I hate this product. And then I use it for a couple weeks, and honestly, like, I learned to love it. So that's, that's going to be interesting, and that's kind of why I want to do it this way. Um, so, 
Yes, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. Also, if you notice, like I have powder on my face and it's dry shampoo because it's just one of those weeks. But we're, we're rolling with it. So um, the first products that I'm going to show you, I've actually already showed you guys in my makeup like my little get ready with me a video I kind of mentioned them a little bit but it is these headbands here so there are three headbands we have three different colors um, obviously the blue one is the one that I'm currently using because it is dirty and I need to wash it but they are very very cute so as I mentioned in my other video I got these on Amazon um, they come in a three pack and these are only $6.99, which is really, really cool. I got it from a company called Fanny, so it's F-A-N-I. And all of these products, I'm going to leave a link in the description, just going over, like, where you can get them and that kind of stuff. But these are $6.99. They are super cute. They are washable, so they're reusable. They're super soft and super stretchy. And they're not going to leave a mark on your hair which is really really cool so like if you're getting ready for an event or something if you have like a wedding or like some kind of other event where you have already done your hair you don't have to worry about you know it messing up your hair but you can still get your makeup done so I love these they're really 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 great and I use them every single day when I do my makeup so that is that they also have like other different designs and stuff on Amazon um, and also from like other different brands so I would just read the reviews make sure that it's a legit product like make sure that you can wash them like all that kind of stuff but they have a million of these on Amazon so definitely check it out um, the next product that I'm going to talk about is this bad boy so this is what the product looks like here and what this is this is an ice roller so it looks really weird and you're probably like what the heck is that but <laughs> it honestly is such a great product so this is this specific one is um by a company called Essorora I think that's how you say it um this is from Amazon of course again it's $11.99 so it's pretty affordable and what this is, is you can put this product in the freezer, you can put this product in the refrigerator, just whatever you prefer. Um, and what you do is it has a little roller on the end. And I just use this to roll my face in the morning and just alleviate any puffiness. Um, just kind of brings blood flow to your face, wakes up your face and gets it ready for the day. Um, I love doing this before I do my makeup, especially like those early mornings that I have to wake up and try to pretend like I'm awake. <laughs> this is really, really great to kind of just wake up your skin. Um, another really great use of this is if you have like bad sinus headaches, like I get really bad sinus headaches, especially like when it storms, like different, different times of the year. Um, or if you have migraines, like even if you have migraines, it feels so good to just kind of roll on your head, especially like if you get the headaches right here, which is pretty much the only place that I ever get headaches. So it feels really, really great to just roll. It's really affordable. Um, a funny story, this is actually my second one um, because I had another one that I got about like a year ago. And... I was living at my parents at the time and I kept it like in the freezer and so when I moved in with my boyfriend I didn't bring it with me because I just I didn't think about it um, and one day like I remembered and so I went back to my parents house and I was going to grab it and my mom was like mm -hmm. she started making a noise and I was like well, I was like, do, do you use it? Do you use this? And she was like, I mean, yeah, a little bit. And I was like, okay. And I was like, well, you can keep it. Like, I'll get another one because, I mean, they're super affordable, so it's really not my big of a deal. And so my mom uses it too. And um, it's honestly just great for, for multi, mul multiple reasons. So 
that's definitely something that I like recommend looking into. It's kind of changed my makeup routine and um, it's helped a lot with like headaches and stuff too. Um, so those are kind of like just a little bit of review of the products that I'm like currently using but I'm not really going to run out of. Um, but let's go ahead and get into first impressions. So these are products that I have recently started using. Um, and I'm just going to kind of give my first impression on what I thought about it. So the first thing I'm going to do is a body wash. Um, this body wash is by Herbal Dynamics Beauty. And that is what this looks like. So this is their chamomile and macadamia gentle body wash. Um, and I actually found this product or this brand on Instagram. Um, and I actually won this product in a contest. I told you guys I love giveaways and I love contests and I have a problem, but I do win stuff. So I mean, I, it's, you know, it's not like a hopeless journey only sometimes but um I won this on Instagram which is really really cool and I recently started using it I've used it like three times now and honestly like it smells so refreshing like it's it's not too sweet but it's not too musky it's just like very relaxing, like very relaxing. And it does make my skin feel really, really soft. It has some great, like it has almond oil in it, rice protein, vitamin C, vitamin E. Um, yes, so it is supposed to soothe um, and promote radiant smooth skin. Like it's just, it's a, actually a really, really great, great body wash. So you can get this um, from their website. It's called Herbal Dynamics Beauty. Um, this costs $16, um, but I really like it. They also have some other really great products. I know that their like toner is really, really good. I've heard like great things about their toner. So definitely check that out if you're looking for some like some skincare products and stuff. I love like these kind of I love discovering new brands like that's something that I really really like like I love discovering new brands seeing what kind of products they have like what's their story like that whole thing and so it's really cool like winning something and getting to try it and kind of discovering the brand along hand so I do really like this guy um the next product I actually got in my kinder beauty box um, that is a monthly subscription box. It's like all vegan, like natural products, like cruelty free products, like all those kind of things. Um, I'm actually not subscribed to it anymore just because I need to save money um, and kind of cut back on my subscription. So I wanted to give it a go for one month, but then after that I unsubscribed just because, you know, I... I don't know, I had other subscription boxes that, you know, I really liked more than this one. Um, even though I really liked this one, it was it was kind of like I had to just pick one. So, unfortunately, I had to unsubscribe. But what this is, it's by, I'm throwing it. <laughs> this is by Zion Health. This is their clay dry deodorant and the scent Sweet Amber. So, it's a deluxe sized um, deodorant. And that's what it looks like so you can actually get the full size deodorant on Amazon which is really cool I love when you can find things on Amazon because it's so easy because you pretty much already have your credit card on file or if you have your address on file and you just kind of got to click buy <laughs> um, it's easy but it's also dangerous <laughs> so this is actually nine dollars like a little bit under ten dollars and this is what that looks like. Um, and I've used it for like two days now. And it's really, it's actually a really interesting smell. So this, this is a very like musky smell, um, which is kind of cool. And like, I know like when I was running and stuff, like a lot of people, like I even tried it, like used guys deodorant because it just it worked a lot better when it came to like sweating and stuff 
Um, and this, like, this scent kind of reminds me of, like, a, a Old Spice or something kind of deodorant, but, but more, like, feminine, if that makes any sense. So if you don't like, like, a musky kind of, like, bold scent, you might not like this, but if you do, this is really good. And I love that it's, like, all natural. Like, it's, it's vegan, um, no aluminum. It's, it's just very, very natural, which is really, really nice. Um, so I have enjoyed it so far, um, and it's lasted pretty, pretty good, because I, you know, I do work out, and I'm constantly moving and stuff, and I haven't really noticed that, like, I need to, like, reapply it, like, really quick, um, but then again, I've only used it, like, three times, so we'll, we'll kind of see how it, how it goes in the future, um, the next product is a mask. This is by Bliss. That is what that looks like. And I actually posted a pic um yeah, I posted a picture on my Instagram story about this mask, but it's their Mighty Marshmallow Bright Radiant Whipped Mask. So this is actually the travel size. This is not the full size. My boyfriend actually got me this um, for Easter. Um, he put it in my Easter basket. <laughs> um, smells really, really good. Smells really good. It's like a pink, pink, almost white, um, kind of texture. Let me see if I can let you guys see it better. Um, but I really love this, and this is actually my second jar, so I have tried this product before. Um, but it's really, really nice. It leaves my skin so soft and hydrated, and it doesn't dry out my skin or anything. Like, it's just, it leaves my skin so moisturized, which is what I really like about it. Um, and you can get the travel size at Target um, for $3.99, so it's pretty affordable. And a little bit goes a long way, too. You don't need to put that much on. So I love that. Um, the next product that I recently incorporated into my beauty routine is my primer. This is by Laura Geller. That's what she looks like. And I actually got this at TJ Maxx. So this is the Laura Geller Sparkle Treatment Even Tone Makeup Primer. When I first tried this, I was like, no, I'm going to hate it. This, I'm going to hate it because... Uh, the smell of it, like, I just, I thought it was going to break me out, to be honest, but it has not, and honestly, it has made my foundation just glow, like, it glows underneath my foundation and just makes it look so pretty, because I'm the type of person, like, I love that dewy finish, like, I hate when it's super matte, and so this actually, this actually has me, like, I love the way that my foundation looks with it. I do have to say, it does not smell good. It does not smell good. It, it smells like nail polish, if I'm being honest, which is kind of a turn off. Um, but just because it doesn't break me out, like it doesn't cause any reaction on my skin, and it does make my foundation look really good, I can kind of look past the smell. But if you're if you're sensitive to smells, you might not like this. Um, you can get this on Laura Geller's, or you can get this on Macy's site for $32, so it is pretty expensive. Um, I got this for, like, under $10, I think even under $5 at TJ Maxx, so definitely check out TJ Maxx. The only thing is, make sure that the seal isn't broken. So, like, when I got this, the seal was not broken, so that's pretty much the only reason that I got it from TJ Maxx, was because the seal wasn't broken, so definitely, like, be aware when you're buying products from TJ Maxx. Um, so moving on, the next product is by Ofra Cosmetics. Um, this is the Madison Miller Collaboration, the Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick in Oh My Rai Rai. And I recently got this product in my Ipsy bag as a add-on. The reason I added it on was because I loved the color. I love the color. Um, I'm wearing a color similar to it right now. It's not this one, but um, I love this liquid lipstick. Like the color is perfect, and honestly, it lasts 
all day long. It's not too drying. Like, it doesn't, like, it doesn't break apart or dry up on my lips. But it's just, it lasts all day long. It's so good. Even, like, eating with drinks and food and stuff. Like, it's so, so good. It's $20 on Oprah's website. But honestly, I think it's worth the price. Like, I normally wouldn't pay that much money, but honestly, like, I think it's worth the price, because it's just, it's an amazing product. Um, the next thing that I have is, um, let's see, what do we have? So the next thing I have is a brow pencil, and this is by Kiss Professional New York. Um, and this is their top brow, fine precision brow pencil in the color taupe. So that's what that looks like. It's kind of dirty, but that's what it looks like. So there's one end has the spoolie, the other end is a fine precision pencil. So this product you can actually get on Amazon again for $7. I actually got this product in another giveaway. Um, I entered a giveaway with Kiss um, Professional New York, and I think it was for their, their eyeshadow pens. Um, they said that they were giving away their whole collection of eyeshadow pens, and I was excited to win. And when they sent me the prize, it included the eyeshadow pens, but it also included like a bunch of other products, and I was blown away. I was like, oh lord. I'm about to pass out because it was so it was like it was so exciting to get that and I can't believe that they added like the extra stuff which was just amazing um this is actually one of my favorite brow pencils I really really like it it's really easy to use it's got a really natural color um I just really really like it and it's really affordable too it's like drugstore price so I love this one um yeah I love this one but anyways, um, moving on to another brow product. This is actually um, one, where am I going? So this is a new product. This is a new product that I just incorporated into, or no, I don't know, I'm, tell, I'm telling you, my brain is not working this morning, but this is a product that I recently used up. I completed it. I'm done with it. Um, and so I'm going to give you my final review on it. So this is Maybelline Brow Precise Micro Crayon. This is in the color... What color are you? Well, I don't know the color, but I think it's light brown or soft brown. So once again, this is like another fine precision pencil. That's the spoolie, and this is the other end. I did like this. Um, I thought that the color was maybe a little bit too dark for me, but um, that's not the pencil's fault. That's my own fault for picking out a dark color. Um, but this is a really, really great drugstore option. I love the fine precision pencils because they kind of give you more rain over your eyebrows and it creates a more natural look and it's a lot easier to do. So this is $6 at Target, so it's very, very affordable. Um, I love Maybelline. If you're trying to like get into, into doing your brows, um, this is definitely a great product to start out with just because it's really easy to use. So I really did enjoy it. It wasn't too waxy or anything either. Um, so I did enjoy that product. Um, and then let's see, the next product that we have is a body wash. Um, this is by Skin and Co. Which before using this product, I'd I'd actually never heard of this brand before. Um, and I actually got this guy in my FabFitFun box, which was really really cool. Um, and that's probably, I don't know about the number one reason, but that's, it's up there. Um, it's one of the main reasons I love subscription boxes is finding and discovering new brands. But anyways, so this is their Blue and Capri Shower Gel. 
And this costs $22 and you can get it on Amazon, which is really, really cool. Um, I did like this body wash. Um, it's, it's got like a strong scent to it and it's, it's kind of more, if I'm being honest, like it reminds me of like a male's body wash scent almost. Um, it's kind of got that like, I don't know, it, it has like sage and basil and autumn blossom in it, but it's just kind of like, I don't know, it reminded me of a, of a guy's body wash, which isn't a bad thing, um, but if you're the type of person that likes like fruity body washes, then you might not like this one, but it did leave my skin really, really soft, which was really, really nice, um, so I did like that. Um, yeah. Yep. <laughs> and then the final product that I recently finished using was this. This is by Schmitz. This is the Rose and Vanilla Natural Deodorant. And that's what that looks like. Um, I actually got this from TJ Maxx for $4.99. I still have the price tag on it. Um, I looked it up online and it looks like you can actually get this at Target for $4.99, which is pretty, pretty cool. I don't know if they're having like a sale or something, but so I did, I loved the scent of this because I love the scent of roses. Um, it's not necessarily the best deodorant for someone who goes hard in the gym. Um, I found that it was kind of rubbing off. A little quicker than I would want it to um, it wasn't like immediate though like I could wear it pretty much like all day and it would be okay um, but I definitely would have to like reapply it like after I go to the gym but I like this deodorant because it's all natural it's very natural it's um, got no aluminum um, no artificial fragrant fragrance like it's vegan it's cruelty free like it's all the things and it smells really really good it's just the whole if you're really, really active, you kind of have to like reapply it a little quicker than someone who's not active. Um, but I do, I do like this deodorant. Um, and four ninety nine is actually pretty affordable for a natural vegan deodorant. Um, but anyways, those are all the products that I want to talk about for today. Um, I'm probably gonna do another one of these videos. A month from now and hopefully go through some new products and um, kind of review some of the products that I am using now um, I hope everyone enjoyed this video if you have any questions about products that I'm currently using or products that I just finished using please feel free to ask me I'm gonna leave like I said I'm gonna leave a link for all the products below in the description box um, if you like this video please give a thumbs up and Please subscribe to my channel if you like me, if you like these videos, um, and I hope everyone has a great day.